Watch the male on the right. He fits the definition of micromanagement. Did you see that? He poked her. As in its name, the acorn woodpecker spends lots of time hoarding acorns in fall to store it for winter in a dedicated tree trunk called granary. This behavior is also known as caching, which exhibits cognitive abilities that were thought to be unique to human. In other words, they are smart. Acorn is not the only thing they eat. In fact, they rely on acorn when other resources like insects and bugs are scarce. In addition, they also eat fruits and drink sap from trees. They are very social birds and live together in small groups. They work together to guard their granary and raise the chicks. In this video, we are sharing pictures and footages of them hoarding and caching acorns. Oh my God, look at that, look at that, look at that. Oh my God, look at that, Elizabeth, a lot. <laughs> Elizabeth, oh my God, a lot of acorns. Oh my God, oh my God, Elizabeth. We didn't see it earlier, we didn't see it. Oh my God, oh my God. They're oh my stocking now. Yeah. They constantly check and move the acorns to make sure the acorns are still nicely fit. And if they found bugs or insects, they would eat them too. Watching them peck, I wonder how they can avoid concussion. According to Elizabeth, a woodpecker's tongue is as long as a hummingbird's tongue, which allows it to lick sap under the bark. And as it closes its beak, the tongue goes all the way to the back of the skull, which acts like a cushion for the brain. In addition, their brain size and position also contributed factors avoiding concussions. If you are interested, I suggest watching the video How Woodpeckers Avoid Brain Injury by Lorna Gibson, a professor from MIT.
It is fun watching a group of acorn woodpeckers deposit acorns into a wall. Very smart for saving food for winter. But look, in this case, how could they retrieve those acorns later?